Alright, this video uh, goes over how to use the Mario Maker 2 OCR program. It'll uh, help you get level information and events from a game feed and then display it on a web app so you can show on stream. So the first thing you want to do is download OBS Virtual Cam, uh, or you'll have to have an equivalent for whatever your streaming software is. <clears throat> then after you download that, you want to go to your actual game uh, capture device, and then go to Filters, Effects, and you want to add uh, the Virtual Cam. So I already have it here, so. And then all you do is just click Start. Perfect. So right now, uh, this virtual cam is taking everything from your game feed and then just outputting it under a different camera, uh, in this case, OBS camera. So then we could use that in the OCR program to actually read the game feed. All right. So now at this point, you could just load the program itself. All right. So not too much to note here. Uh, depending on how good your computer is, uh, you could select a different resolution. For me, uh, when streaming, I actually had to do it on 640 by 480. Port 3000, this is the port you want to run the web server. You could have it, uh, it'll show all your webcams here, but you really just want to choose OBS camera. And that's it. Just hit start. You can see right here, it started the web server on localhost 3000. We could open that up. You see there's two uh, web overlays available. So right now here, I can pull them up on different tabs. There's the SMM bar. And then there's this one called the DRAM bar. Uh, right now there's actually nothing on screen because there's no level being played. So back in OBS, you could just actually add these here. I could, as a browser source. So if we go into the filter, I mean, the properties, you see DRAM bar. Uh, really the only thing is you wanna have, you wanna have the correct address, and then you just wanna make sure you have this checked. Refresh browser when scene becomes active. Uh, this way you could just easily refresh it if needed. So if I display both these, and then play this level. Oh, we don't want this. this one. All right, cool. So these are the two available. Um, if you're into any web development, you could it'd be easy enough to just make your own. <clears throat> and as you could see, the uh, the level information shows up on the top, and it also shows up here, depending on you know whichever uh, overlay you want. It keeps track of deaths, level timer. Um, the OCR is. The optical character recognition, it's still being improved. Uh, so like right now, you could see there's like an E and I guess it's it's not able to read in that character. But overall, it's like it works pretty well. So yeah, that's pretty much how you use it. Enjoy.